For almost 130 years, the Halifax Shipyard has shaped Canada's naval history, and to date, Irving Shipbuilding has built 80% of Canada's current fleet. Now, a new chapter is underway. It is our privilege and responsibility to build the next generation of ships for Canada at the largest and most modern facility in North America. A building over four football fields long, located adjacent to the Royal Canadian Navy Dockyard. From coast to coast to coast, Canadians are benefiting as this project grows our economy and creates new opportunities for research and development. It starts at our facility in Dartmouth, Nova Scotia, where massive steel plates begin their transformation. Fueled by information from a digital 3D model, these plates are cut to measure on state-of-the-art equipment with incredible precision, welded into I-beams, and curved into exact shapes. Specific forms are cut as needed, and pipes are custom crafted on site. Each part is labeled and kitted by job for transport to where construction continues at our Halifax shipyard. There, a team of highly trained shipbuilders assemble the parts into their final forms with cutting edge equipment. In North America's largest undercover shipbuilding facility, an ultra modern workplace designed for ergonomic efficiency and safety. This work is conducted using the most modern processes to ensure these complex ships for Canada are completed on time and on budget. First, plates are marked, welded, cut, and assembled into deck and bulkhead panels. Once outfitting, welding, and painting are complete, these units are assembled into blocks. Special equipment and hundreds of kilometers of cable are installed as these blocks are joined together to form mega blocks. These megablocks weigh several hundred tons. The complex outfitting process continues, but on a larger scale as more of the ship comes together. The megablocks are moved to the land level on heavy lift transporters to be joined. Final testing is completed as the ship is brought to life. At this time, compartments also get ready for commissioning. The ship then moves using heavy lift transporters onto a launchway barge. The barge is towed to open water where the ship is floated during a controlled launch. After launching, the commissioning of compartments and equipment continues as the ship prepares for sea trials and delivery to the Royal Canadian Navy. But ships are just part of the story. The economic and social impact of this project will benefit Canadians for generations. Over 1,000 companies, large and small across Canada, have registered to work with us and Canada's Industrial Regional Benefits Program ensures that we spend 100% of the value of our projects inside Canada. That means for every dollar we spend internationally, Irving Shipbuilding or one of our top-level suppliers invests the same amount here at home. These investments are already fueling jobs and research at companies and universities across the country. In addition, we are investing in people bringing in international talent and training our current and future workforce. A new generation of shipbuilders is being trained with a focus on diversity. They will follow through on our 30-year commitment to delivering the best ships for those who serve. It is our honor to partner with the Royal Canadian Navy to help strengthen our country's workforce and economy and to ensure Canada can take its place on the global stage. The work is underway. The ships are being built by the best workers, with the best equipment, in the best facilities. We are constructing a legacy for our Navy and our country. It is indeed a great day to be a shipbuilder.